Oh, why did I just back away? God, I thought I could get the last shot on him. Damn it. God. Oh. Hey, this is Tamara, signing on with some more of Dark Souls 2, Scholar of the First Sin. Alright, last time we did some more traveling around, we bought some very expensive items, and used one of them up for basically no reason. Anyways, but okay, we opened up a shortcut, we fought some tortoise guards, we are very close to a new boss. Now we can't get across there, how do we get across? Okay, either way... Okay, so take the elevator up. The boss is either... Uh-oh. I thought it would go up. Am I in trouble? Do we have a problem? Nope, okay. Still going down. I'm worried about those salamanders. And that's just a drop, so don't go down there. Uh, I see you back there. Don't think you can hide. It's locked. Come on. Alright. Now this... Wait, which boss is this? Is this either... I'm trying to think of which boss this is. Because it might not be the one I was thinking of. Don't look at me like that. I thought you giants were dead. Okay, this was not the boss I was thinking of. It really wasn't. The last giant. Nip at your heels. Nope. Yeah. I mentioned it before, but there was this war between uh, King Vandrick and the giants, and it seems like the giants were pretty much eradicated. He even invaded their own... Ow. He even invading the giants' country... So yeah, it was kind of a big mess, and if this guy, maybe he's just dormant, and yeah, he's just angry, frustrated, and confused. Oh, Jesus, I forgot he did that. This is very, like, an amygdala thing from, amygdala from Bloodborne, but okay. I was really close. I got cocky. I go, okay, go for that leg, because he keeps jumping over the other one. Oh, there it goes. Okay, no problem. Close, but is it going to be one of those things like, oh, almost got him the first time. Try again. I know what to do, and then I just keep getting farther and farther and farther away. Guess we'll find out. Guess we'll find out. Okay, yeah. He was, I, forgot, I forgot about that boss. Again, this is not the most popular Dark Souls game, but... It's been a while since I've played it, let alone, you know, beaten it, let alone played it. Or the way. You get the point. But it is fun to be re surprised by this game. Still see you back there. That's a good moment to get in a couple of big swings. Nope. Ah. That's exactly how I died last time, is because I got cocky in that moment. Ah, shoot. Nope. Uh. 
Pop that last Estus. Your heal is mine! There we go. Sorry, guy. Now, there are no giants. Soldier key, soul, last giant. Yeah, last giant. What are you doing? Get out of here! Again, I've gotten these trophies before. I've beaten this game before on this system, but I don't know what PSN's doing re-lighting trophies I've already gotten. But, okay. Soul of the Last Giant, now we have a key. Locked. Okay, apparently that's not what the key is for. Where does the key go? It could go... Okay, I'm trying to think of where this key could... What door is this key used on? How do we get over there? Jump on that. I don't want to try it. Like actually, we've got a bunch of souls, so it might be. New soldier key. Okay, good. Crap. I probably shouldn't hit this way. Let's head back. Let's take the bonfire. I think we're close to another boss already. I'm trying to remember. Right, was that here or was it somewhere else? I'm trying to think of what is where. Okay, anyways. So, no, we got a lot of souls, so we're gonna head back to Majula real quick, cash those in, build ourselves up. What's that turtle doing here? Where, where literally, where did you come from? I'm confused. Oh, wait. Oh, I just realized something. Hold on. For, we're still going to go to Majula first. Let's not be stupid and risk losing all those lovely souls. We don't really need to buy Well, I could buy it. Nah. Not that interested in the FGs that that person has. Okay. So, fast travel to Majula. I'm going to take a bite out of my hot pocket real quick. Oh, I did find a shard. I forgot about that. Did I find... There was only one, right? Okay. Actually, wait. Before we do that... Before we do that... Open up. Yep, there we go. Blacksmith's open. Ah, yes. Now I can get to work. But get first, to work, then. Let me set up. I think if we just teleport away and come back, he'll be ready, but we'll check that. We'll check out the mansion real quick. Short bow. Okay. Maybe do some upgrading? Nah. No, if we put all the levels in leveling up, we can then handle some more weapons. I'll go, okay, let's go to the mansion and go check out that map. Nope, wrong place. All right, so let's go talk to this guy here. I don't remember if he had anything I'd like. Oh, hello again. Uh Sixty-eight, maybe? Sixty-eight, forty-three, seventy-four... I'm just trying to think. I don't think you can compare. 43, 74, 43, 31, 55. Okay, hold on. Okay, so if we... Uh, equipment, 38, 74, 35, 55. God, I wish I could compare. 38, 74... Forty-three, seventy-four. Still, probably better bonuses. Thirty-one, fifty-five. 
Sorry, I got a fly on my nose. I might buy a couple of things. Sorry, I wish there was a better way to compare. Uh, 35, 55. Okay. So I will buy... Nope. Not only until you get better at stock. Okay, so it's a much cooler helmet. Uh, oh, I already had the thing you said. Whoops. Oh well. Whatever. I got a tasty helmet. All right now, let's cash everything else out into <clears throat> levels. Bearer of the oh, I forgot mansion. Hold on. All right, so. I want to increase strength some more. How many levels can we... Okay, we can buy four levels. Fine, we'll put it all into decks. So now can I use different weapons? Can I wield a halberd? No, I need more dexterity. Uh... I can at least use a greatsword now, so that's kind of cool. Just in case, where is the... Oh yeah, wait, where's the fire sword? Oh, it's still... Well, fire damage is still a modifier. Suppose we'll keep it in a second spot, just in case. Nope, mansion. Sorry, I'm going. Trying to break stuff. Pharaohs. Okay, another lockstone, so that's good to get another one. Oh, that's not a chest. Okay. And here's the map of Dranlaic. I'm not sure what it actually means. Just, we got a fire there. Is it supposed to tell us, like, what areas are completed or something? I don't know. I don't know. There's some kind of mysteries here, and I don't... I don't remember what that does. So, yeah, not much here, just a skeleton. Although, I wouldn't be surprised if we got back up. I think that's it. And a torch. Okay, it's an interesting area. But I thought there was more to it. Or I thought maybe there was maybe a snow secret to the map. I don't remember. We'll find out. We'll go give her that another rest of shard, and then we'll move back to uh, that the place we were at. I forget its name. Wait. Why don't I do this? It's one of the oldest Dark Souls tricks. Okay.
Worth a try. I didn't think it would kill him, but... Yeah, it's one of the oldest Dark Souls tricks to, like, mess with an elevator in order to open up another thing. Alright, let's try that again. Oh, sorry, I'm stuck. I'm trying to finish up this hot pocket. That's how gross I am. In game, not in real life. To a degree. I wonder where that leads, although it's probably right into that fire pit. Uh oh. Yeah, great sword's powerful, but it takes a while to swing. Teehee. He follows me on the dead. I'm just curious what's down here. I don't think I've ever been down here. Nope, going deeper. That's a death drop. Oh, wait, it just leads to the same. Okay. I suppose it didn't occur to me it would just go to the same spot. Hmm. All right. I'm genuinely curious where he went. I don't think he fell and died. Okay. Maybe he took the other elevator. I don't know. Go this way. So I'm pretty sure there's a boss fight up here, although I'm not don't remember which one it is. There's two in my mind right now, and I'm curious of both. Or it's just... Okay. Nope, it's stopped. Okay, it was wiggling a bit. Okay. I know which one this is now. I remember. The one I'm... The one I wasn't... One of the two I've wanted the least. No, there is a way. Okay. Hold on. <clears throat> so, nail soldier, life gem. Cool. So, here we go. This guy gave me a lot of problems the first time I played through, but here we go. Things have been different, so let's see if things go different. That guy's back. We saw a glimpse of him on our way here, and yep, this time it's for real. Real. Now there is something we can do. We can mess with these ballista. Nope. Yeah, we're back in that one. Bash you. Yeah, he's got just big combos, and I just had a hard time trying to beat him the first time I played. And though, yeah, I just had a hard time. He was like my first major hurdle when I played Dark, first played Dark Souls 2. But then I go tell my friend that, and he goes like, oh, I beat him on my first try. And I'm like, what? There's no way. Crap, yeah. So yeah, but that's something interesting about Dark Souls, is like some bosses will give you or other people, different people, different problems. And for me, like, I just could not read him. Although, I 
thing is I've already wasted most of my Estus, so... God hold towards his shield, not his sword. Yeah, okay. Well, not a bad first-ish. Needs powers on his health. So, okay. So now we know we can just run up back to him, try again. <clears throat> so, so what we shall do is we shall try again. I'm trying to think. What could I use something that would make that easier? Oh, I got pine resin, don't I? I don't know. I'd imagine heavy metal, apply magic, okay. I imagine a guy in heavy armor is gonna be vulnerable to electricity, but that's just my assumption. No, not use, ah, damn it. Well, I better run. I better run and maybe I'll get a chance to use it on him. Probably not, it'll probably wear off right when I get to his door. The idea was there, but... Oops. Stab me in the butt. Well, it's still sparking, but for how much longer, we'll find out. Quite a bit of damage. Ah, damn it. I should back up and heal. What am I doing? Okay, yeah, so that was actually quite effective against him. God damn it, I should not have done that. Leave me alone, just for a second. Damn it, I dodged in the wrong direction. Okay, so Pine Resin is pretty awesome against him, but that was the only one I had when he's rising up when the battle starts. It's enough time for me to probably put on some ooze. This is not a weird thing to say. When he's rising up, I got a chance to ooze my sword. Okay. Come on, you. Come at me. Come at me, you punk. Okay, it's effective. You were just short of range, otherwise I would have been freaking dead. Alright. Keep my distance. Usually when he does that charge attack is when I got my best op opening. Nope, that was bad. Already cursed. Damn it, ah, frick. Damn it. I'm 
Right, that was another move he did that really screwed me up. Shoot, damn it! Ah, okay. I didn't want to use another magic because I thought he'd kill me. Okay, yeah, this guy. This freaking guy causes me problems. We're gonna beat this guy before this video ends. And how does fire work against him? I doubt well, but then again, I'd like to imagine fire on big, bulky plate armor. Imagine it's not comfortable, but who knows. This we'll find out, we'll test it out. Otherwise, magic is my best bet, and I only have a limited uses of those, so. Damn it. I can't use it. All right, let's see how fire works against him. If I could find a way to use the ballista, I could. Okay, that actually is kind of. Ah, damn it! If he had not done that, I could probably could have used it. Oh, come on. I got pulled into it. I'm trying to remember what Curse does, but it certainly doesn't help me, and it looks like it buffs him up. Thinking about his name, the Pursuer, if I, you know, because Lord Vandrick was worried about the, un the undead Curse would ruin his land like it did Lordran. So the pursuer must be a guy who hunts down undead to make sure they don't ruin the country. Okay. Yeah, or the nation. You know what I meant. Okay, crap. So if you get him in a... That's... Mm. The idea is there. The setup is... I just get... Once I start losing, I just panic, and then... And then he curses me, and that's also, like... That buffs him up. Okay, so this fire sword actually does work pretty good against him, at least decently enough. Works better than my axe, and I don't, if I run out of magic stuff, you know, I got an alternative. Okay, we're gonna beat this guy before we wrap up. Because we can, we almost did, and we will. Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. I don't know why I'm using it one-handed. Nope. Ah, that was close. I honestly should not have avoided that. Ah, oh, damn it. Rolled the wrong direction. Don't touch me, don't touch me. God damn it, the healing didn't kick in. Ah, uh, damn it, okay. Should have been paying attention to where I had a crit, and I thought I did, and nope. Ah, frick, okay, fire sword it is. Shoot, this, this freaking guy. Oops. If I had used the Estus flasks instead of the use, then maybe I would have pulled it off. Crap, okay. Try again. We'll get this guy, it's going better than it did for me the first time, which is to be expected, but still. It's going not bad, but it could be better. Actually, now that I think about it, okay.
right. Stand there for five seconds. Thing, I don't know how you can line up. Apparently, it's super easy. I have. Interpreted that. Got greedy. But I don't, I don't use them anyways. Okay, his poise was broken, but then I didn't have any stamina. Get away from me! Stay back! Oh, crap. Come on. Freaking close. I bet there's a mark around here for a helper, but I don't want I don't want one. Okay. So I changed the ring around, I did something else. Come on, this time for sure. Please, please, please. We got this. Think. Let's take it in bites. I, I thought that was going to be the end of his combo. It's going great. Damn it. Got 
one free shot in. I walk through your sword when it's not moving. Okay. I'm good. Staying cool, staying frosty. I should just shut my mouth. Oh, phew, okay, sweet. Victory achieved, how freaking yeah. 17, 100 souls, 1,000, ah. Ring of Blades, Soul of the Pursuer. Freaking sweet. Go away! I don't want you ruining my victory! Okay. Oh, come on. Okay, running. Uh, where the hell do I go? Okay, more people picking on a giant statue. Oh, crap, I'm in trouble. Okay, at the very least, let me pop a gem in me. Okay, sweet. Okay. Took a bit. Nothing happened. Yeah, another giant statue we can't mess with yet. Okay, I know this was not a dead end, so where is my way to advance? It's down there. Oh, let me double check. Okay, I think this was the way. Ah, burn! Yeah, the eagles are coming! Guardian seal, okay. Okay, we got through him. Took a while, but we got through him. And then this guy leads us to the Lost Bastille. Ouch! Good thing I wore my foul damage ring. Oh no, I didn't. The Lost Bastille. Sweet. Got a couple of chests near us. There's a bonfire. We can take a nap. Human effigy. Okay, now we're in another spot of the Lost Bastille. But we also have Dull Ember. Okay. I think we cut across there, and that's how we get to. Maybe? I'm trying to remember. Okay. Nevertheless, so we only have one way to go. And that, I think, will lead us back to. I think that's the guy we have to get through to open that. No. Is it? Okay, whatever. Either way, we are taking a rest. I think I'm going to tr travel to Manjula. We're going to. Or, yeah. Or Majula, we're going to level up real quick and then we will head back here and try and get through this. Because again, I know where the boss is, I got a clear path, and it's just I needed that route. And now that we got it, we should be pretty gold. For a while, anyways, until we get to the next boss, because he's also annoying. Alright, so until next time, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe and all that. This is Tamara, signing off.